Welcome to a video from the DigitalLifes.com. We have a new Windows 10 build to look at for Windows Insiders. This is build 17661. This is going out to Windows Insiders in the skip ahead option and those using the fast ring option as well. So we're both options now receiving Redstone 5 builds as Redstone 4 builds have been finished. So what's new in this build? Well, they've actually done quite a few things. We've got a new snipping experience. So there's the new app, it's called Screen Sketch. Let's fire that up. So this is part originally was part of Windows Inc. workspace and um, you can now let's try and capture a window. And I say, I say, I want to capture the whole thing. Oh, look, we can even capture a zone there. That's quite interesting. There we go. We captured that zone. Let's capture a rectangle. There we go. We've got that rectangle. Notice how here now we've got tab for each one as well so we're not losing what we've done previously which is which is good kind of the old one just used to go to the clipboard didn't it and uh, what's this option here full screen so we can grab a full screen on there and then it of course it's got tools so we can draw on these I haven't got my surface pen down here at the moment but if you had a surface pen I could draw on it and I've got the drawing tools, so like the ruler, and all the, mod all the modern tools really that from the ink workspace, the uh, sort of the, the um, some of the tools that came with the um, with the surface, you know, design for the surface for drawing and things like that. So that's great. That looks that's pretty good. There's some uh, nice shortcuts as well, like uh, what have we got? Windows Shift and S. There we go, that creates one, let's just, we, so we can create one like that as well. So you can also make trigger this from the, from the pen, you can trigger it from the print screen button, and there's an action, it should be an action center, let's have a look. There we go, green snip, full screen. Well, it's good that I must I must admit that uh, I like look. I do use the snipping tool a lot, so that'll be good to see. Some other things in there. Sets is continuing here. As you can see, I can add a tab here, and I could pick an Inter Explorer page, or I could have uh, Word or Excel, and I've got tabs all over in in Windows. Um, some people aren't going to get that, and some people are. So not in, all insiders will see sets. So if you previously opted in to skip ahead and as sets enabled you'll carry on to see it if you didn't then you won't um, I've did a couple of machines and one went straight from the fast ring to this build and it did get sets other changes we've got um, the acrylic look in um, in task view as you can see we've got that transparent look uh, there's improvements to windows security setting improvements to focus assist when gaming we've got more options for sound in uh, settings as they're migrating these over to the new um, to the new system you can set your preferred special audio options um, there's a lot more in here now than there was uh, in the previous build there you go you can see some of these options now that are removed from the old sort of control panel way of doing it there's improved uh, window improved HEIC support which is a high definition image format uh, you can see things like date taken I won't dive into those now but uh, you can have a look at those in the in the release notes and there's other things like uh, narrators improved with sets out of box experience has been improved for setting the PC up with history sync uh, skin tones have been improved in emoji um, they've fixed the issue with game bar and they've fixed some pen issues there's quite a lot of known issues VPNs may not work and you have to follow a guide you have to basically delete a, a file from Profiles Microsoft Network when, 
and so on. So I'll include a link for that on the dislifestyle.com. Uh, you may have some issues with multi-users opening the store, resuming from sleep. Still issue with um, movies and TV that we've talked about on all the videos for some time. And um, one thing I did and I found myself is if, you appear, if your PC appears to be stuck at preparing to install between 80 and 100 percent, please be patient and wait 30 minutes for this stage. And I had exactly that. I had to wait. I tried two machines and had the same issue. So those are the main changes. Uh, so we've got a nice new tool there with the screen sketch. I'm going to uh, try and integrate that into my workflow a bit and see how I go with that. So we're on Redstone 5 now. We're all on Redstone 5 out later this year. And uh, you can find our previous Redstone 5, Redstone 4 and right back to the Windows previews on our YouTube channel on thislifestyle.com and on Twitter at iStixon.